Hello friends, welcome to the Technohelic. In this session, we will get the knowledge of the OAuth. What is the OAuth and how does it works? So let's start with the what is the OAuth. OAuth stands for the Open Authorization, which means OAuth is all about the authorization, not and the authentication. For authorization and authentication, you can check the description. OAuth is an open standard authorization framework for token based authorization on the internet. OAuth enables the end user's information to be used by the third party services such as Google and Facebook without the exposing the user's account credential to the third party. Here we can say that in OAuth, we use the token based system for authorization rather than the user's credential now let's see with the some examples suppose you want to use the online video editor to edit the videos and the, all the videos are already uploaded on the google drive so download all the videos from the drive and upload them to the editor it takes some time that means you need to give the access to the editor to access your drive folder without the sharing your own credentials as per the security concern we don't want to share our credential with anyone so here oauth is introduced to authorize the person to access the information from the drive without the credential now see how oauth works so first when you want to the access the Google Drive via online video editor, you ask to the video editor for that access the Google Drive. Now, video editor requests for the access token to the Google Drive. Google Drive asks to you for the permission. Like, do you want to give the permission to this site? And now you need to authorize it if you want to give the permission or decline it if you don't do not want to the permission so when you are allow the authorization it will be create a new access token and this access token will be assigned to the this online video editor so google drive create the new access token and send to the video editor so now whenever video editor requires your google drive data they are sending the request to the Google Drive with a access token and Google Drive check your access token is valid or not. If your access token is valid, they are sending to the response data to the online video editor. So this process is called the OAuth. Now we will see with the live example. In this application, I want to the access of my Google account for authentication of the, this application. So Whenever I click on this Google account, it will be redirected to the Google authentication process and after that it will be asked for the authorization. Okay, after the authentication, yeah, this is the authorization pop up. Google asked me for the authorization. If I am allowing it, it will be redirected to the EBS book with some access token. So now we see with the network so whenever i click on the confirm button yeah you can see that google send the access token to our ebs book application so this is our the new access token and by this access token ebs book try to get the information from the google and authenticated me in the ebs book platform i hope now you understand what is the oauth and what is the use of oauth if you get some useful data from this video please like it and share it also please subscribe to the channel